We are at the Delaware Speedway for round three of season one of the SCRL Tim Hortons Canadian Series. The double zero of Al Legacy will be leading us to the green flag star beside him is the three of Max Anderson. The rest of the starting lineup. We got a couple of part timers in this field uh, the 48 in the HVK, the 12 of Bulldog 67, the 82 of Chuttle, the 13 of Kaka Silverpaw. These drivers missed the original sign-up, but signed up to run a part-time schedule where there's more than 35 cars on the track. So, I'm pretty sure some part, some full-time drivers will be complaining and saying they're taking spots away from drivers and possible points, but they got the right to be here, too. So, And yes, I said Delaware. This is not Dover, Delaware in America. This is Delaware in Ontario, Canada. So, we are still doing Canada, of course. This is a Canadian series. 30 laps around this little track. Hopefully it'll be a fun race. And here's the command to start the engines. Drivers, start your engines! This will be a 30 lap race. We have had two different winners in the first two races. And we've had green white checker finishes in every single one of them so far too. Zachary Fitzwater won the season opener at most sports and Raleigh Sproly tube won at iCar. So what will happen today here? Oh, we got a car smoking. Oh my god, new HPK. That is not what she wanted. She's a part-timer. Al Legacy in his third ever start in this league will lead him to the green. We are racing at Delaware. Three wide for the lead. Here comes Kaka Silverpaw. Trying to make a move. And the unsponsored number 13 dodge. Oh, we got contact. No caution. And leading the first lap is Kaka Silverpaw. Off into turn number one again. We got battle for second. Evan Rudd trying to go around Owl Legacy. Completes the pass. 82. Chuttle trying to move up. The all-time race winner with 20 wins. His closest competitor, Aureus, uh, is semi-retired. So, Shuttle is just in a world of his own. 29, Dean Drinker trying to move up. A multiple-time winner in this league. That has never won here in Canada. A silver paw is just pulled away from the rest of the field. That is very typical of this track. Long green flag runs. And little... Spins and cautions. Nick Kennedy moving up. He could have, would have, should have won the Formula Championship, but mechanical problems in the last race spoiled those. Bulldog 67 tied with Nita HPK for second with the most wins. They're both tied at 13. Our legacy who led us to the green is about to be passed by the 7 of Jay Barker. Kaka Silverpaw is just dominating this race. Five laps completed, 25 to go. That, that's pretty cool to have an unsponsored car leading the pack. Not that this league shows bias towards any driver because it is all fair, but when you see an unsponsored vehicle leading a field full of teams that has multi-million dollar sponsorships, and this car has none. That shows you the talent that driver has. Silver Paul has won uh, several times in this league, but has been in and out. He's been an infrequent driver now and then. Of course, we know Chuttle. Oh, oh we got a caution. Yep. Looks like the 15. Whoa, Keenan Bush with a lot of damage to his unsponsored vehicle. So we got a caution for the first time here at Delaware. Our race leader is the 13 of Kaka Silver Paul, and we will take a look and see what brought out the first caution of the day. Okay, these drivers are going three wide. Joe Jefferson, Chris Kyle, and Max Anderson. Looks like Joe Jefferson slides up the track at the same time Max goes low. And Joe, oh my God. Wow. Jeez. I did not see that. 
Hard impact by the 0 1. Then the 42 gets involved, the 9, the 8, the 98. And that's where the 15 got his damage, Keenan Bush. He ran into the 3. Driver's just scrambling, trying to avoid. Keenan had nowhere to go and just plows the three. Hard. These drivers just scrambling for, <clears throat> for position. So this is what? <clears throat> Two out of three races we've had a car flip over. Oh my god. Luke Rainey was lucky he didn't get more damage than that. I'm telling you, man, when they wreck in the sleek G's. I've never seen so many cars flip at short tracks in my life. Jeez. Well, I'd say about one, two, maybe three cars will be out of this. Unless Keenan Bush can get his damage fixed. So that brought out the first caution of the day. Joe Jefferson teleports back to pit road. And we'll take it back to the restart now. About to get this race restarted. The 48 in EDHPK is out due to a broken camshaft. And the 0-1 of Joe Jefferson is out due to his wreck. Pace car is back in. And we're back to racing at Delaware. Silver Paul trying to defend against Truttle. Truttle trying to go for his 21st career win. He has one win in the Canadian Series. He won at Cataluga in the preseason a while back. Oh, Silver Paul on the wall. So Truttle trying to go for his second win in the Canadian Series and 21st overall. Evan Rudd trying to move up. And another unsponsored vehicle. Oh, Truttle hits the wall. Here comes Evan Rudd. Oh, there's Keenan Bush on pit road. The 22 is on pit road as well. New race leader, 97. When we get to the line this time, we will be halfway. Oh, the caution is out. I just saw it. Not sure what happened this time. That must be major because the caution is out. The 97, Evan Rudd is our race leader. We'll take a look and see if we're out the second caution of the day. So here's what happened. Nick Kennedy racing side by side with Keka Silver Paul. And Kennedy just slides up the track. As Silver Paul is going down, <clears throat> Kennedy gets turned into the wall. Then the 44, K. Nareen gets damaged. Nick Kennedy spins. And that was it. We had a little tiny spin like that, and that brought out the caution. So this will be a quickie caution, and we'll take you back to the restart. A half a lap away from restarting this race. No one else is out of the race. We have a couple cars a lap down, the 22 and the 15. The 89 is two laps down. We're going to get the green with 10 laps to go. Pace cars in. We're back to racing at Delaware. Up, uh, up. Uh. Battle for second. Ding Drinker wants it. Nope. Evan Rudd continues to hold the race lead into turn three. Into turn four. Cars in the wall, that's all right. Evan Rudd trying to defend against Shuttle. Oh, caution is out again. Whoa, 0 4, a lot of damage. The 98, a lot of damage. Remember, we do have an option of a green white checker if it comes to it. Evan Rudd is still our race leader. We'll take a look at the caution. All right, the 98, Chris Kyle going in turn three. Oh, he hits the 0 2. He loses control and he hits the 5 of Grayson. Oh my god. Oh, he's. 
hard impact by the five. Jeez. And at this point, they just start stacking up. Zachary Fitzwater got damage. New paint scheme for him. The drivers just try to avoid. They go on the pit road trying to, you know, get away from the caution. And Kyle comes back across the track and hits the eight. Then Luke Randy gets damage. They just start stacking up behind him. And the nine gets damage. But that was a hard hit by the five. That's, there's no safer barriers here. Because we're using the 2006 version of the track since that's the latest they made. We'll look at it from this angle. Oh my god, that was head on. Look at the wheels. Jeez. Hard impact by the five. Obviously, he's okay because he's driving away, but hitting concrete walls like that could give you a concussion and whatnot. So, hopefully, that driver will be all right. And we will take you to the restart now. And we are back. We're going to get the green with four laps to go. The 5 and the 04 are both out of the race. The 15 is two laps down. The 89 is two laps down. The 22 is one lap down. Evan Rudd is our race leader. Second is Shuttle. Third, Dink Drinker. Fourth, Bull RC7. Fifth, Jesse Turner. Sixth, K. Nareen. Seventh, Derek Edison. Eighth, Al Legacy. Ninth, Alexander Rowe. Tenth, Nick Kennedy. Oops, I think I made a mistake. Oh well. Pace cars in. And we're back to racing at Delaware. If a caution comes out between now and and the checkered, the race will end under caution, but we will have the one attempt at a green-white checkered. Battle for second. Dean Drinker wants it. Chuttle trying to defend. Evan Rudd trying to go for his first Canadian win. Oh, Chuttle slides. Here comes Dean Drinker. This is for position. While Evan Rudd continues to lead. Bulldog 67 trying to pass his former rival from the Legend Series. Oh, we got a car flipped over. I just noticed that. On pit road, but oh well. Next time by will be the white flag. If between now and then we get a caution, we will have a green-white checkered. No caution. No caution. White flag. One lap to go. We will end this race under green. Evan Rudd looking for his first Canadian win. Battle for second between Boyle 67 and Ding Drinker. But it's not going to matter because Evan Rudd will lead him off the final turn and score his first win of the season here at Delaware. And they wreck. Oh, my God. Jesus. They wrecked at the caution. Uh, it doesn't matter anyway because the race is over. What a race. Harry race results. Evan Rudd scores his first win of the season. Second, Bulldog 67. Third, Ding Drinker. Fourth, Alexander Rowe. Fifth, Al Legacy. Sixth, Nick Kennedy. Seventh, Jay Barker. Eighth, Chuttle. Ninth, Troy McClure. And tenth, Riley Spurley Tube. We had 21 drivers finish the race on the lead lap. We had a lot of drivers a lap down during the latter half of the race because they got damaged during caution and whatnot. We had 30 drivers finish the race in total. Everybody out was due to Rex, aside from Nita HPK, who broke a camshaft at the very start of the race. So that is it for Delaware. We actually had a green flag finish in regulation. And we will take you to victory lane for the very first time this season with Evan Rudd. Here are your point standings after the third race of the season at Delaware. <clears throat> Nick Kennedy is our brand new points leader. He has a five-point lead over Al Legacy. Third is Alexander Rowe, 45 points back. Fourth, Jesse Turner, 50 points back. And fifth, Riley Sparley Tube, 62 points back. Sixth is Jonathan Reigns. Seventh, Jack Legacy. Eighth, Jay Barker. Ninth, Keka Whiteline. And tenth is Troy McClure. Eleventh, Chris Kyle. Twelfth, Zachary Fitzwater. Thirteenth, Eric Wayne. Fourteenth, Keenan Bush. Fifteenth, Betty Barrett. 
16, Evan Rudd, 17th, Dane Drinker, 18th, Max Anderson, 19th, Tony Newman, and 20th, Jay Jefferson. 21st is Cassie Waz, 22nd, Kay Nareen, 23rd, Joe Jefferson, 24th, Kyle Mentz, 25th, AJ Jones, 26th, Ling Ling, 27th, Colin Dryberg, 28th, Bulldog 67, 29th, Derek Edison, 30th, Grayson H. Vidu, 31st, Luke Rainey, 32nd, Kaka Silverpaw, 33rd, Nita HPK, and last is Chuddle in 34th position. So that is it for the third race of the season at Delaware. We will see you at the fourth race at Canadian Tire Motorsports Park.